The cliche goes, a picture is worth a thousand words, unless you were Paul Guidry. KD man lost a big chunk of his throat to cancer and now has to use that electronic voice box if he wants to speak. However, parts of the device do not work well, so a high school senior figured out a better way. Melissa Correa has more in this month's Texans Helping Texans. When acid reflux caused Paul Guidry to develop throat cancer in 2015, his only option to communicate became this electronic voice box. That's great to tell the noise, the tubes, throat the noise to the back of my mouth. And that's all I'm able to talk. Except the oral adapter, that part that holds the tube, cracks a lot. And they last about four months at 30 bucks each. Paul's wife, a teacher at KDISD's Miller Career and Technology Center, knew a student could figure out a better way. I, I want to be an engineer when I grow up. I, I just like making things. Jurgis McSennis just needed three weeks and a 3D printer. We modified the design to add a barb so we can slide the tube on and touch the come off. And I added some things like... Like Paul's name. The first one was too thin, he made it thicker. Then the tip broke off, so he made the tip stronger. Seven prototypes later. And now he's able to print it for around $4. The custom redesign of Paul's oral adapter is so good, Jurgis is headed to a statewide engineering competition. Paul's convinced the 18-year-old will win. Absolutely. Yurgis says he already did. I found my purpose, and I think my purpose is helping people. A $4 fix to help a neighbor find his voice leaves one KD teen speechless. Seeing my project work, uh, I don't know. I, I can't describe it. <laughs> because sometimes actually stepping in to help it's says more life is really simple. than words ever could. Melissa Correa, KHOU 11 News. How about that? Amazing. And Jorgis will present his redesign at a statewide engineering competition in Corpus Christi next week. His creation will only cost Paul $4 instead of the $30 Paul was paying. All right, a few